Bruh. Hey guys, I'm back for some more Art of War 3, and today we're gonna be playing. Not us. But a special someone has sent me a video to uh, commentate on. Because they claim that it's just an epic, hilarious, and funny video. Now, I did get a file of 23 minutes long, so I'll be uh, fast forwarding a couple bits, a couple bits and parts, to uh, make this video as engaging and epic as possible. Now, without ado, let's get on with it. Of course, as you guys can tell, this is not the Resistance, but it's Confederation gameplay. So, you guys can expect Vertex Thor's Zeus Shield, Torrents, uh, and maybe some walls. So yeah, let's let's see. Okay, so assaults are shredding coyotes, which seems unnatural. Okay, but now with rifleman support, the uh, big container will be for the resistance. Also, blue in the chat is getting kind of toxic, kind of, that's kind of sus, imagine getting toxic in a 3v3, that's, that's just, uh, hella sus and sad at the same time. Oh, purple deltas are doing some good damage, but I don't think they'll win. I mean, dang, only four deltas was enough to take down a platform. Pretty good, pretty good. Purple's got some strong deltas. Now, although these three confederation players did pretty decent in the beginning of the match by scouting, destroying platforms, uh, they still didn't get a proper scout on the enemy. We only know that yellow, the enemy yellow, has a, a sort of naval presence. Other than that, they really don't have anything to go off of. So it's gonna be uh, kind of a tough one. All right, blue's going for HQ4, and the green is doing something at HQ3. All right, we can see blues building walls. Now that blue has aviation, they were able to scout and uh yeah. Resistance isn't doing that well. Their I green the green resistance is still at HQ level 3. Uh we didn't get too much of a scout on red. And yellow is still pretty much unknown. Okay, blue is sending torrents down south to help purple with possible defense. And the green's got a strong enough army to defend. Especially since that bridge looks very narrow. Lots of porcupines, but the vertex is able to dodge the missiles quickly. Blue sending torrents up north. Oh, Vertex is coming. Lots of porcupines. But there has to be way more porcupines. Blue has almost 12 Vertex. Oh, all it took was one salvo to destroy that gator. Chameleons are coming, although blue has torrents at the ready. Force firing is going to take place, and since it's a bridge, it's going to be very effective.
It looks like the Vertex is cleaning up the remaining units. There is a, there's a couple of Porcupines. But again, there's a lot of Vertex, so there's got to be more Porcupines. The Gators are force firing, but they're not really hitting anything, since the Zeus are out of range. Blue sound attack. And all the defenses. And there's dwarfs. The Confederation green is right on the resistance green. Uh, dealing some really, really good damage with those Vikings. Although, now... The Confederation Green is going to going to be attacked from the land. Although I don't think it's going to be that tough. Since it is of course a bridge. And the bridge can be uh, force fired onto. There's a lot of Zeus tanks here at the ready as well. Yep, looks like they're attacking. But this is a bridge. So... I mean, they don't kill on bridge. And you're in vertex. I'll skip to sign this. I'll win shot T2. Only a lot of them need a single vertex. Not important. Looks like the red blink went down. Still a lot of vertex. Looks like they ran out of fuel. Even with their slower speed, they're barely taking any damage from the anti air. Doors are up, we'll see where they bomb. Looks like they're heading in for Yellow's base. Okay, successfully took out the HQ. That'll set Yellow back by quite a bit. Pretty much all of the HQs for the Resistance are destroyed. So, they're... they're uh, Unit production will be tampered with. And it also, it also appears that they're going on a counterattack. But come on, man. A bridge again. You should never send units on a bridge like that. I'll be again. And let's start the again. Electric air is not and the meat is held to the Those are in the defend. Oh, that's a bomb. The second bomb war run was actually quite good. Both of them were good, but the second one... That's a great one. That's a really good bomb run, man. And now that Blue has sent Torrents to help... There is no way they're going to win. There's no way the Resistance will win this one. Okay, another round of uh, Navy is going to attack, and Blue looks like he's going to go for another airstrike. Okay, one shot the level three special vehicle. Factory, one shot the level one special vehicle factory, taking down the construction yard. Oh, yellow rebuilt the HQ over there. Yeah, at this point, yellow really can't do much. Yellow is crippled, and the only thing that attacked yellow was Vertex and Thors. Red switched to a Dragonfly production.
Oh, purple is building a space system. Although purple, you, 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 you don't really need a space system now. I mean, you, you got all the land units to successfully strike them. And blue has such a strong air force to one-shot all of the HQs. And Alright, blue's telling green to uh make Poseidons, but it doesn't look like green's listening. Although I mean, come on, you you I don't think you guys really need Poseidons. It's going to be a victory easily though. Alright, looks like purple says they're going to space strike red. And blue is holding out the bombardment with the torrents. Well, not holding out the bombardment, but is creating a bombardment with torrents. Tactically bombing the... Not... I don't think bombing is the right word. But I'll use it anyways. Okay, Thor's was shot down. That's a lot of porcupines. Lots of anti-air. Okay, purple's requesting an attack on the red HQ. Will blue comply with that request? Okay, okay, nice. Oh, blue's doing an attack on both HQs. Oh, it looked like it worked with very minimal vertex. Oh, is blue going to go for the other? Oh. Dang, blue took down three HQs and didn't even lose the entire air force. That's that's pretty confed, if you ask me. All right, looks like green's moving out those Zeus tanks. Looks like a space strike is going to hit green as well. That was a really strong space strike. And red is doing a last ditch effort attack on purple, but it's not going to work. Okay, looks like blue is going to be mass producing Poseidons. Poseidons will pretty much wipe them off the face of uh, of this map because Poseidons can literally attack almost any building. That's just how this map is built. This map is built so that if you have a naval presence, you will win. Another space strike is charging up. Although green has been told to make Poseidons, green still making Vikings for some reason. It's not really working out for green that well, but the game is pretty much over.
By their affirmative and affirmative, I assume that the enemy has surrendered. Since that is what most people say when they have won to their allies. Okay, looks like they're going on an all-out attack. Another space strike. There's a couple of buildings here, but victory.